you know, all throughout the city, it's just, you can smell smoke, and I don't think it's from the forest fire. <laughs> I think it's from people burning stuff, because it's just a little chilly out. I gotta say, ghee and uh, red beets are a tasty match. Red beets are terrible by themselves. But, what's the ghee gonna do to me? Is it gonna make me feel like I have a heart attack again, like regular butter? <clears throat> okay, so we would have to be away from the building in the glass? Yes. Out of the street where we can meet up our car. Yeah. And away from the electric wire. And then, and then we're going into the so other like park in a little bit. The middle of the road? Yeah. <laughs> well, I, I think this is safer because there's no glass. Yeah, but the electrical wire. And the fence. Oh, electrical wire. Yeah. Alright. I don't know how long it's going to be. Well, I think it's going to be on to the other park. Oh, I saved her! We got the librarian! Yay! Yay! I opened the window though, I was going to escape that way. Earthquake. Did you though? <laughs> okay, earthquake drill. <laughs> Great. What's that chair for? California State House. Thank you for cooperating. Yay! And if there was a big emergency and things were burning or whatever, our gathering, <laughs> our gathering place is in the park, right down there where they just put up the fences. That's the library's corner. Yeah. So anybody from here would be doing this. I don't know if everybody can see his t-shirt, but this is what, if you're, if you're inside and there's a, a earthquake hit, you want to drop cover and hold on. Look around, make sure things aren't going to fall on you when, when it does stop shaking, etc. So. And in a uh, Napa earthquake, all the books fell off the shelf, so they're projectiles. So all those shelves, even though they're bolted, the books, the books are going to go like that. Yeah, the books are Yes, and you don't want to like head towards where there's going to be a pile of, of books. Okay, I'm going to take a picture. Oh. Or, 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 or one. Here, everybody in. Everybody oh. in. Oh. Oh. picture with you with the no, shirt no, no, no. out. <laughs> yeah, let me come on. <laughs> yeah, we're having an earthquake. Oh, yeah, you're looking at the teacher. Yes, we're going to Okay. I'm just going to go like this. Mike's not being in it. Like, we have to act like I've got my t shirt. I can't fly. All right. Yay! Thank you guys. Alright, yeah, thank all you for right. participating. Good job, everybody. Thank and you. Now we've all got the best patrons. Look at that. You guys are Everybody. Everybody. Alright, well, I was wondering what the a dead end, what was at the dead end, and it looks like it's a cemetery. Oh, there's a gate. They got it locked up. That's too bad. Food bank is supposed to be down this way, somewhere, somewhere down this, just down this road. There's somebody up there. Today's only Thursday. That's chilly. Oh yeah, here we are. General. Yeah, there's the office. Hours. I don't really need to go inside. Just wanted to make sure I could find it. Food distribution right there. New hours. Okay. Back on the Highway 1 here. And uh, if you can't stand behind our troops, feel free to stand in front of them. Giant Jenny's Giant Burger. That sounds good. So there's a, a major bridge over there. And it's probably for the, the train. It's a skunk train. 
and there's no sidewalk here not too desirable to walk on looks like there's this worn in though like people hazard zone for tsunamis okay not too many people walk this you know there's different qualities of these neighborhood watch signs <clears throat> it's kind of amusing you know you got ones that are beat up and look old and look like maybe they just kind of abandoned abandoned the whole deal and then others look kind of ornate and new I'm waiting to see one that's flashing one with bright flashy lights to really highlight that they're into their neighborhood watching that would just be amusing <clears throat> maybe they could have like a LED sign in some way for this that just flashes out the, the lights with with little s different slogans each week looks like there's still some lumber left here on their property so Georgia Pacific looks like we can wrap around it <clears throat> I remember years ago my dad pointed out once that uh, there was a brewery in Rice Lake Wisconsin and I think that he probably liked that um, history because of the smell the breakfast smell that you, that comes off of the brewery but why he wouldn't have mentioned it well I think maybe that that also in Rice Lake that that brewery there put off a breakfast smell but he just he never mentioned that but that's something that gets my attention because I was like what smells so good and I see a brewery over there it's just uh, one of the qualities of it I never noticed this uh, warning before keep frozen cook thoroughly I don't have anywhere to cook it I've been kind of eating them every so ever so often maybe every few weeks uh, these peas are not the best raw but I gotta just they say don't thaw I let them thaw there's nothing I can do it's so frustrating to deal with this lack of cooking all right I mashed frozen peas in with my muesli and it doesn't taste too bad maybe it could be a replacement for milk or not maybe just a temporary substitute in between once again it's so easy to ask me the guy walking by you for change when you got all these other cars who are more likely to have spare change on them but it's more convenient and easier to uh, ask somebody else walking along the sidewalk I just, I don't see the purpose in it. And it's October. I wonder if they'll do okay in the, over the winter. It's like a Spanish style old church repainted refurbished <laughs> and they, they really are took me back into the emergency room and uh, my doctor called and i'm on a gurney in emergency So they got a sanctuary here at the fort. Purple lights night. Advocate news got shut down. Alright, I stopped at this the main the only food bank in Fort Bragg. I got these mushrooms, I ate one, and it doesn't taste right. 
It's it's like metallic without the metal. It's so strange. I don't know if I want to eat any more of that. Corn tortillas. Uh, from the oh, I think it was made in Santa Rosa. Santa Rosa. I wonder if that building got burnt down. Lots of fruits. This cantaloupe. Pretty decent. Lots of fruits. I bought. I got that potato because I want to try to cook it on the on the block engine. But yeah, oranges and oh yeah, the the avocado. I'm not exactly hungry, so I guess I'll just be sitting on this food. Maybe I'll eat this this kefir cup. Maybe I'll have that with a separate, I guess a granola thing. Granola, that's the thing, it's, they always add sugar. When you see granola, they always add sugar. Little box of raisins. And I've never seen this one before. Pandan leaves extract. I'm a little concerned. No expiration on it. So that'll be an experiment. So that's about it. There's more I could have taken, but... I just want to take it easy.